Thinking about designing or updating an existing catio? If so, this video is for you. Over the years, we have built one of the largest catios around and have learned a thing or two about catio design. Today, we're talking about that space above the whiskers and ears. Mm -hmm. Roofing. We have so much to share, so let's get started. The catio experience should be a stress-free, safe and fun way to be in the great outdoors. We'll start with this light and airy roofing design with our catio patio. Notice the roofing is the same fencing as seen on the sides of the catio. Our catio is connected to several trees. It's no secret that cats like trees. Inside this catio, our roof design was bumped upward for the ultimate tree experience. Green 16 gauge PVC coated fencing was weaved between the branches creating a dome shape inside the tree. It did take a while to make the dome, inserting a small patch by patch, but it was well worth the time. The cats are in it every day. The main fencing used is 14 gauge and six foot wide. All fencing panels are powder coated. Powder coating protects the fence from rust and can last up to 20 years. Each panel was connected using heavy duty zip ties and stapled to the trees and frame using a pneumatic staple gun. This small covered entry platform was also incorporated in our catio design. Here's another example of an open airy roof with a small tree feature. Similarly, the tree dome was created by cutting small patches of a 16 gauge fencing and carefully weaving them over and around branches. All the fencing was attached to the framing. Not every day is going to be bright and sunny, so we have a plan. Nobody wants to get caught in the rain or snow. For inclement weather, we encourage all designs to include some form of shelter. We like the polycarbonate panels as seen in our green catio for several reasons. They come in different colors and are very durable and lightweight. What? Mm-hmm. Chameleon. This color is called misty green. The panels can be cut with either a handheld grinder. I found metal shear cutters were much easier to control. Notice the panels are attached to 2x2s and 4x4s in the framing. Be sure to attach the panels using recommended screws because they have built-in washers to prevent water leaking. Along the cat walkway, we chose a darker color panel to blend in with the landscape. The panels are attached to the walkway with heavy-duty zip ties as seen here. Did this video inspire you to create a custom catio using the roofing designs discussed today? We invite you to check out our YouTube channel for catio design ideas and other cat projects. Meow for now.